Young Astronomers. Welcome back to our cosmic journey as we explore the last four phases of the moon. The moon's ever-changing face continues to inspire wonder in the night sky. Are you ready to continue our lunar adventure? Fantastic! Join us for the next five minutes as we unveil the secrets of the moon's later phases. Now, let's bask in the glory of the full moon, the moon's superstar phase. During this phase, the moon is like a radiant circle of light in the night sky. It's fully illuminated and lights up our world. Full moons have inspired stories, legends, and celebrations throughout history. Next, we enter the waning gibbous phase. The moon is like a gibbous-shaped beauty, but it's starting to say goodbye. It's getting smaller, and you can still see most of it illuminated. The moon is setting later in the morning sky. Our lunar journey nears its end with the third quarter. The moon is like a half circle of light, just as it was during the first quarter. But now, it's the moon's last quarter before it becomes a new moon once more. Our lunar adventure concludes with the waning crescent moon. This phase is like a delicate sliver of moonlight. Crescent means that only a small part of the moon is illuminated, and waning indicates that it's getting smaller. It's a quiet farewell to the lunar cycle as the moon prepares for its new beginning. And there you have it, our cosmic journey through the last four phases of the moon. These phases complete the moon's cycle, from new moon to full moon and back again. The moon's phases have fascinated sky watchers for generations, and they continue to do so. Remember, young astronomers, the moon is not just a distant object, it's a part of our shared sky. Keep looking up, keep observing, and keep marveling at the wonders of the universe. Don't forget to subscribe for more exciting educational adventures with us. Join us next time as we continue our journey through the wonders of our incredible universe. Thank you for joining us on this lunar adventure today, my young friends. Until next time, keep watching the moon, keep exploring the cosmos, and keep reaching for the stars. Goodbye, young astronomers.